mistaken. Ten pesos, if you please. Well done, senor. Excellent. And all I did was sit on his back. Oh, three. No, the heart. Put St. Anthony on the griddle. We're to meet in the cathedral. Have you forgotten that you crossed swords with Lieutenant? Why do I have to meet every swordsman in Madrid? Everybody enjoys a scene in the arm or shoulder, and they boast of having met you. Explain that to him, will you? I'll tell him I'll meet him tomorrow. Your attention, please. I'm buying wine for all. He's ordered me home. The Commandant just told me. I sail on the first ship from Lisbon. Indians troublesome? No. Then who is there to fight? Central missions, happy peons, sleepy caballeros, or senores. To California. Or I'm... So gloomy, my friend. People cannot sing with hatred in their hearts, senor. Kinder, better man never lived. You don't know him, senor. I've taken 20 lashes before for a slip of the tongue. No, not exactly. I was born and raised not far from here. Where can I get a carriage to drive me to Los Angeles? Well, wake up! Didn't you hear me? Here's a caballero who would employ you. He's the son of His Excellency, the Alcalde. Well, stop staring at me. Will you drive me or not? You are too late, senor. Your good father has already attended to that. My father, what are you talking about? Excellency, cut out his tongue. I swear it is true. Senor. He claims to be the son of Alcade. I claim nothing. San Diego, I've not heard of your returning. Welcome to California. I'm Capitan Esther. Conditions have changed since you left San Diego. Your father, Ross, they're encouraged to think of their own affairs. Weed. Who holds the office now? Don Luis Basilio Quintero. I'll take you to him. Oh, thank I'm quite sure that you, uh, you'll save me a reprimand. How could I? It's a foolish habit of mine. Some men fancy the weapon. Oh, I. I know very little about it, my dear Captain. A bloody battle. Uh, the sight of the pit. All the people were covered. Arrested. I'm asking 40 pesos for him, Excellency. One centiva will he cost you. <laughs> That's a better attitude. And what caballero is... Ah, I thought such fabric came from Madrid. Must have a welcome back, young sir. Regard this house as still your home. Money, money, it's always money. <laughs> I don't know this caballero. Ana Ines de Quintero. My wife, senor. Senora. Those clothes. Your pardon, senor. We're overwhelmed by the latest... ...the splendor of Madrid and the court. Have patience, my love. You'll see it also. How easily he makes pretty speeches. I regret... You were saying, Don Diego? Me to these barbarians. Come to the shops with me and help me make my... Satin and silk. The matching of one delicate shade against the... and musk. Excellency. Capitan? <laughs> the Capitan is jealous. The Papa suggests your eye might fail you. It's possible. Very charming. Well, he must be, from the color in your cheeks and the look. Flatter a woman. When can I meet him? Listen to the child. A woman grown. I'll be 18 my next birthday. Carmen Castellano is only a dull gust in your veins. Keep it cool, my girl. I pity your... See? She didn't flick an in. Switch on the taxpayers? Only when they're stubborn. Adios, senor. Adios. <laughs> My son. <laughs> Hello, Manuel. Si Jose. Where's father? 
I tell you, these conditions are beyond bearing. Oh, yes. But what do you do about it? Nothing. What can... <laughs> Welcome back to your home in my heart, dear. Have you returned to steal more melons? Melons? We were visited by the father of all belly aches. <laughs> <laughs> Is he without a face? Can't you see he's even better looking than when he left? Oh, I'm sure. An angel. That's what we need in California now. Son to me. Sit down, Diego. Sets a viper. So foul and so black. But why did you resign in the first place, Father? Res the friar urges me to lead the caballeros in a revolt, which the law is the law, my son. I will not rebel against the government. I that is my feeling also. Sometimes one must fight fire with... Oh. No, no, of course not, Father. Oh, by the way... Scorpions, agreeable rattlesnakes. <laughs> oh, Pat. Well, that being the case... I'd be moved by injustice and cruelty until it touches us. While I was in Madrid. It's all the rage just now. <laughs> Watch closely. <laughs> into a puppy. Bah! I'll see you later, Father. them with me. For us, my love, for us. I see. How stupid of me. Don't move. A bandit. I have this trustworthy excellency. I will act for him. Hand it over. I can't afford gallantries. I refuse. You dare not take it. Quickly, senora. I should hate to mark. <laughs> I faint. You won't. Zorro. Uh. Ridiculous. Has anyone entered this room? His Excellency and yourself. Anyone else? Did I dream that? Ah, Zorro is somewhere on the grounds. Find him. Say the Gandalf. That's what I'd like to know. And it's your business to find out. Well, what did he say? Mm -hmm. Now we have something. This Zorro is a couple of pesos a year. I can't collect it if I'm dead. And you get a third for protecting this house, night and day. I can't afford to lose you, my dear Luis. No. Replace. Someone I can love and respect.
looked to you when I came in. I'm not Fry Ramon. I was asking the Holy Mother to save me from a convent. Well, I mean a young girl with your, uh, uh, <clears throat> yes, yes, of course, in a way. In... She is to flourish. You follow me? Well, I... Pray of God. I was praying just now for her husband. Uh, yes, but it, it's not natural for a girl of my age to love. talk to me for a little while. I'm troubled deeply. I want to leave this lonely place. I, I want to meet young people. They, they hate my Uncle Luis. Well, hate him, as you say. You have your answer there. Well, I was right. Probably your aunt feels that that atmosphere is better for Maria you. says she's jealous. She says it's because I'm... Are you sure? No one except Maria ever says I'm pretty. You... You really think that? With all my heart. I hear such words every hour of the day. <sighs> you know... You're wearing a sword. Oh, oh, lock the doors after we leave, Frau Ramon. The beast may... Senor, I cannot pay so much. I swear to my family. Nine pesos. Senor. That's all. Get back. Supervoss at Maniot Semper. Amen. Amen. I took the liberty of riding over and setting up the men. Diego. Good evening, Sergeant. Good evening, Senor. Zara, you said. How long have you been here, Senor? Some little time. Seems. <laughs> of sorrow? Oh, heaven spare me. My blood chills at the thing. Thoughts of that bandit? Puppy! See you, the last of the beggars, trembling at the very mention of... Thank you, Mother. <laughs> oh, and this I took from his charming wife. It's pretty, don't you think? Trying to make me the receiver of stolen goods? No, Padre. My boy. Then you will lead your people against these scorpions. Your mercy when you took the gold and the necklace from him. I would have snuffed him out like a... I see everything. Diego. But I must. 
My father's such a stickler for law. I may be able to persuade him to resign and name my father in his... <laughs> I beg you to make yourself comfortable, senor. She'll be down shortly. Thank you. Uh, what can I do for you? Have you forgotten, Excellency, that you earned... Oh, no. No, I had a note from Doña Ines asking me to ride with... <laughs> Come into my study till my wife appears. <laughs> Excellency, tell me, why is this house so close? Reassuring. Uh, let me show you something, young man. He came here one night. He threatened my life and left that. Quite mad. You think so? Oh, of course. He's a madman. Cunning beyond belief. They always are. He... Oh, my dear. Oh, it's a pity your sense of duty keeps... I'm so sorry to have kept you, Don Diego. Esteban was surly about how to... Let's fly. I'm dying for a canter. Oh, goodbye, Louise. Don't... Like this Zorro. He thinks I'm running a great risk by staying here. Oh, forget your fear. Point him in your place. What do you gather from that? We can at least help the situation. How? Have a husband. What could be stronger than a matrimonial alliance? Not bad. Not. Talking with you is like, like a drink of cool water in the desert. Oh, please. Of what were you thinking? Well, I was thinking more civilized than this provincial life you're leading. Oh, I know. Yeah? Well, go to Spain, but not with Esteban. Go to romantic, beautiful Spain with Luis? Well, let me explain. Hold your fortune, you'd be completely ostracized. Oh, I see. But not you. You need only one friend to introduce you. Oh, Diego. Utterly impossible. I'll give the girl a dowry of 20,000 pesos. No, this. You come here in broad daylight on a friendly mission with half a company of troops. Final administration. I would never appear to condone it by a marriage between our families. His Excellency has offered a marriage between his niece, Lolita, and you, dear. My father resents my efforts to make the people of the district more, uh, uh, industrious than... You'd marry into the family of this... Well, how can I tell until I've seen... It would desolate us to have her leave the nest. If she were Venus, she'd still... But, Diego, don't you think the wishes of your father in this sort of... Will you dine with us tonight, Diego? Charmed. We'll expect... What have you done? Oh, it'll be all right, Mother. You gave Luis the idea of this marriage. An alliance for the good of... Yes, that is natural. Shall I bow or give him a... What can be keeping him? Don Diego Vega. Pro oh, fellow. <laughs> oh, heaven spare me, senora. I am honored, senor. You'll forgive me for being late, senora. They heated the water. Life can be trying, don't you think? Yes. <laughs> His bath was tepid. <laughs> oh, how frightfully amusing. Speaking of that Zorro, Excellency, could you provide me with an escort home? Certainly. Apparently, you don't approve of my request, Senorita. You caught her. I happen to admire courage. Dashing about with a keep. A madman, that's what he is. A madman. To regard that poor fruit as an enemy. A fencing instructor in Barcelona. <laughs> How exhausting. He was involved, I believe. The gentleman's wife, no doubt. Somewhat. With me. I would so love to have you show me. Gladly. Que te ponga en mis, mis brazos, que te me cante a ruar. I found it rather fatigued. Little dove has flown. I don't like it. 
seen together anywhere in Madrid without the slightest danger of gossip. Or a hand in marriage. A refusal would crush... <coughs> such things. And it's time that you understood that... <laughs> you! Don't come in here. I don't care to hear anything you have to say, so unlock that door and go. I'm glad to see you took the advice I gave you in the... Say? You're more lovely... You are sorrow. Yes, Lolita. In order to accomplish... I understand. You don't have to explain. Oh, go quickly. Go be careful. You seem upset, my dear. This marriage was your uncle's idea. The man's not at all the type for you tonight. My heart bled for you, my dear. When you tell Louise you... for me. But nonsense. He has no right to tolerate Diego. I do so you think repulsive. We'll talk of it. European styles. Bustles are coming in, it seems. Bustles. She said, those pole cats, and you sit there, planning to decorate your delightful friends. What have you done about that girl? Lighted with her. What have you done? Well. What is that? Lolita can tell. She attracts you? So for some time ago, and uh... You're concealing something from us. Tell me as soon as you can. I will, Mother. What's the meaning of that? What's to prevent it? The total disappearance of Sergeant Gonzalez. <laughs> I think he's dead. Dead? Dead, you say? Oh. How is the little one? She is well again. I brought this, Cito. This is for the church. Gracias. I come at precisely the right moment, it seems. Hand them over. I refuse. No wonder you chose the church. Hey, run me through and have done with it. It'd be rather amusing to live with the Quinteros. Oh, if I'd only left him in Señorita Quintero. <laughs> Father, this is Lolita. I am honored to alone for a moment, Diego. Senorita, will you answer me one question? Well, I, I love him, senor. He is like the flower. It's Zorro, and they're going to hang him. Well, where is he? Look. Well, if that becomes necessary, will it make any difference between... Stand, please. There's someone in that chair. She's him. Really? It's distressing enough to call on my betrothed and not find her at home. Where is Lolita, Excellency? No one seems to know. Oh, died without a duenia? I protest, Your Excellency. We arrested him today. No. And another horrible thing happened to me this morning. But after all, it... He may change his mind about you. Those creatures love me. What you need is a drop of brandy, Excellence. Stupid soldiers! You know, I... I... You rang, Your Excellency? Yes, brandy. On my constitution in a week. But then I... I haven't the iron... Guard! You, follow me! Look, Your Excellency! 
Here in the cellar, right below my study. Wait. Couldn't have gone through the wall. He's not you. You're right. I'll leave this cursed place. I'll do as he asks. A man should consider his wife. In there. This? Look it over. This Zoro will kill me if I stay. You're in even greater danger than he thinks. So you tried to get good. I ask you to change the subject. His Excellency objects to talk of throat cutting. Quatu You wouldn't care to translate that feeling into action, would you? Please, gentlemen. No, this is going much too far. Diego. Esteban. I'll make it. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Please. We have a hero with us. Get out. Are you tiring, Diego? Oh, Excellency, I'll take you on in a moment. It's a good effort, Captain. Firm enough to run you through. I needed that scratch to awaken me. He's dead. Uh, Quick, Marcella, we just discovered it. A secret stairway. Very good. <laughs> Excellent. You shall. Take him to the guardhouse and lock him in a cell. Reasons. First, you have mud from the cellar on your boots. And that's exactly where you're going, Senor Zorro. No more of your wit. Take him away. I want all caballeros and all peons summoned here at once. Tidens, immediately. At this hour? Ridiculous. The Alcalde's orders. Yes, Diego. I don't know. Luis won't tell me. He must have... Ladies to stay in your rooms tonight. Why? I cannot say... Uh, uh... What do you know about this, Alejandro? Nothing. I was forced to come. Good evening, senores. It's a pleasure to see you here. I'm executing a caballero at midnight. Aren't you here to see him die as a lesson to the lot of you? Too bad you're about to lose the best actor among you. But Now observe very closely. Watch the candle. You should really see something worthwhile, like uh, changing a copper coin. Century been handed down through a long line of sorcerers and magicians to... Senor, do that for me, eh? Oh, I'm very weary. I'm a secret. I go for them, and they'll pray for you. Please. Senor, gracias. Tightly now. Si, senor. Now, put your fist well through the bars. Look about it. Come on. Si, senor. <laughs> Hola, senores. What idiotic joke is this? Have you seen this one, Father? Oh, me! Are you with me? I am with you, Diego. Oh, no! His Excellency is... Quiet! Quiet for His Excellency! Uh. Good people of Los Angeles, my health is uh, endangered. 
to succeed me as alcalde of this district. Off of San Pedro. Yes? I wish to bless your voyage. Spain? Oh, Diego, when may we expect you and our dear... ...and raise fat children and watch our vineyards grow? 